two years after retiring, I never experienced this when I was working. Hi everyone, you got it here. Today I'm going to talk about things that happened two years after my early retirement. I'm outside today because my husband is vigorously working on the downstairs bathroom and it's so loud and it's so nice. Just five minutes walk from our house and wind is still kind of cold so I got this uh, gigantic crazy earmuff with me. Anyway, I want to talk about the things that I've never experienced when I was, when I was working, when I had a full-time work requirement. If you find it interesting, please smash the like button and subscribe so you will miss the how and what of our, our retirement life. So my husband and I delayed our dream nomad living in other countries due to COVID and took time and obviously still taking time to remodel our house to sell. Our goal is to put our house on the market by our wedding anniversary in May. That's our goal. That goal. Do you have goals in your life, big or small? You know, since my early retirement, I started seeing my goals differently. When I had a goal to retire early or do well on my previous work, I felt more clingy, like feeling kind of tight. Well, like honestly, my goal was to get to the weekend. I tried to enjoy the process and the everyday moment, and I did, but this strained and stressed feeling was still there. Now those feelings are gone. I feel more free now. It's not that I don't aim higher or I don't have any plans or anything. It's more like I found peace with the flow of my natural state while working toward my goals. I used to be rushing and running to achieve something outside me, but now I ground myself with peace in the present moment with gratitude. I am living and enjoying right now, every day. Rather than chasing something, I notice and appreciate small things around me. The morning walk to the water with my family, you know, to here. It's just like five minutes walk to the water and it's really nice. The birds and the trees in the sky, playing with neighbors' dogs and cats. The refreshing smell when I cut fresh vegetables. The freaking vegetable smell is the highlight of your early retirement. Even salary, you might say. Well, sure, I do salary. But anyway, you know, I thought the highlight of my early retirement is my freedom to do whatever I want with my time, travel wherever I want, whenever I want but it turned out to be every moment of my life. Well, I may, not, I may not be doing much, but according to food standards, yours, my ex-employers, or Elon Musk, I don't have quarterly performance review anymore. So I think we tend to be busy and unhappy with chasing what we think would make us happy or what we believe is the right thing to do when what makes us happy is right in front of you. Coco, your breast is fishy. Another thing that happened two years after my early retirement was that money is not a concern as much as I thought it would be. Maybe because, I mean, it's only been two years or maybe because I did everything I could to prepare for my early retirement. Still, I thought I would be worried you know, my husband is not working, I'm not working, inflation is happening, Russia is super crazy. We're just letting our investments work for us for another 40, 50 plus years. I mean, we seek investment opportunities for fun, but we're pretty laid back. If you are thinking about retiring early, you may be scared, but if you did your due diligence and did everything you could, you'll be fine or you will make it to be fine. You know, don't trap yourself into analysis paralysis to figure out every single detail that could go wrong because I mean, anything could happen. Trust your research findings and your guts and go for it. Lastly, two years after retiring, I feel like I'm becoming more of my true self each day. 
because I don't have to fit in. I thought I was pretty true to myself before, but I guess I wasn't. You don't need to retire early to feel these things. I just started to feel in this way more after retiring and I thought it's an interesting reality of my early retirement. Thank you for watching and see you in my next video.